Good evening. Welcome to the News at 6. I'm Marion Davidson. Thanks for joining us. Our top story tonight at 6, the Helena Police Department will soon be looking at hiring. A lot of it. MTN's Jonathan Ambarian found out what goes on behind the scenes when it comes to filling open positions on the police force. Helena's police chief says the department is preparing to be significantly short-handed going into next year, and it may change how they handle some non-emergency calls. We will be answering emergency calls. We'll always be there for, we'll always have to prioritize emergency calls. It just may be delays or um, different types of service on non-emergency calls. Chief Steve Hagen says HPD currently has three open positions, with six more set to leave by the end of January. Four new officers have been hired but are still in training and aren't working on their own yet. That means the department would effectively be operating with 13 vacancies after January. HPD has 53 full-time equivalent positions. Hagen says he can't point to a single reason for the rise in departures, but many of the decisions are tied to family. I think a lot of what's happened is uh, over the last year or two, a lot of people have really reflected on what's important in life, and a lot of people are going back to be near family. And that's the most, that's the number one common theme. The Helena Police Protective Association, which represents patrol officers, said in a Facebook post last month that they don't feel enough has been done to address this issue. They said, quote, For some time now, there has been very little emphasis put on recruiting new officers, retaining existing officers, and increasing our local police force proportionally to Helena's population growth. The result has been an increasing workload for existing HPD officers. Hagen says they are working on ways to deal with staffing issues. They're looking at shifting some responsibilities from officers to civilian employees. He says the number of vacancies will drop as officers finish training, and they're seeking applicants with law enforcement experience who can start sooner. We have a very unique niche in law enforcement here. We're looking for officers that work well in the community. Not everybody can do that. So that's we're going to keep focusing on hiring the best candidates we can hire, even if that means working short until we get those. Hagen himself is retiring at the end of December after staying on two months longer than he originally intended. The city is still finalizing the plans for the transition. In Helena, Jonathan Ambarian, MTN News.